weather now as we take a live look outside. It's exactly how Derek said it was going to be. Exactly. Cloudy, rainy. And it, was, it was really wet <laughs> earlier today, though. Yeah, and kind of a it. soaker out there. But, yeah. you know, it, it'd be nice to get some more piece of sunshine. What was it, a couple of days ago that was so nice outside? Oh, I know. Sunday. Unfortunately, I don't really see anything like that. Uh, uh, maybe next week, but it's going to be a little while before we see that because we yeah. have more chances for rain on the way as well as some dense fog for your morning commute on your Wednesday. Let's get right to it. Show is going on, on the radar right now. We do have, are tracking some showers over across parts of Northern Virginia and the and the uh, Virgi West Virginia Panhandle. But the, all the rain that we had earlier today is long gone. You can see how the storm system evolved through the night last night, uh, taking that track off towards the north and east, and it brought us a good soaking rain last night. Here comes our next batch of rain that is coming in from the south and west. We're also going to be watching you know, another area of low pressure that's going to develop off the North Carolina coast, like this past one that's going to track up towards our area here by tomorrow morning. Dense fog expected overnight tonight. More rain arrives here by Wednesday afternoon. Some areas could actually see rain a little bit earlier in the day, particularly over on the eastern shore in southern Maryland. Right now, Thursday and Friday afternoon, Look better. I mean, they, they, I'm being optimistic here by saying they look good. It looks like it will be drying out, but there may be some peaks of sunshine there, particularly as we go into your Friday. Here's a look at that dense fog overnight tonight. Look how quickly the numbers drop here. These numbers are visibility in miles, and notice how quickly it drops down to less than a half mile in some spots, maybe a quarter of a mile. So just keep that in mind for your morning commute. It's going to be a little dicey out there, maybe a little slow, so allow enough extra time to get where you're going. And then it looks like rain is going to take over here by mid to late morning into the afternoon as the primary issue here if you're going to be out driving. Temperatures into the 50s across the area, so nice recovery from this afternoon. McHenry's right now is at 64. So dry out in far western Maryland as temperatures tonight will fall back into the upper 40s to around 50 degrees. Again, that fog developing after midnight tonight, moving out here by mid to late morning tomorrow. And then we've got rain to talk about. A couple of areas of energy we're watching. This one out towards the west is causing a little bit of rain through the deep south. And then we're going to be watching another small area of low pressure that's going to try to develop. These two are just going to kind of merge together and give us those opportunities for rain. So here's a look at your future cast. Foggy overnight tonight. Temperatures right around 50, some upper 40s. And then watch what happens here as we go throughout the mid to late morning into the afternoon. Look how quickly this rain just spreads into the area. So the evening commute tomorrow looks slow and wet and sloppy. That will continue through late Wednesday night, and then the system will start pulling away from the area here as we go into a Thursday. Maybe a lingering shower into early Thursday afternoon, but overall it looks like things will be drying out. Notice how the rain chances go up quickly here as we go into the afternoon. So early morning, fog is going to be the problem. Afternoon, it's just going to be wet roadways. So across the state tomorrow, mid to upper 50s under a mostly cloudy sky and a good chance for some showers. Here's your first alert 7 8 forecast. Of course, we've got daylight saving time beginning on Sunday. So, of course, set those clocks forward in case you don't have one that does it automatically. Otherwise, look at, looks like we have some more chances rain right here other than tomorrow and the Thursday morning coming in on Saturday. So, a little wet first half of your weekend. Not much we could do. Exactly. It, it is what it is, right? Yeah, at least it's not freezing cold. So, <laughs> that's I, true. I agree. <laughs> Made it all better. Looking for the silver lining. Thank you, Derek. <laughs>